After so long on the road, you'd forgive Ben Smith for being a touch tired. Not a bit of it. One last sprint across the line to end his feat of endurance. Thank you! And then a kiss from his boyfriend Kyle, who'd helped him achieve it. I'm, I'm, I'm overwhelmed, honestly. I know I keep on using that word today, but like, look, you know, the crowds of people that have come out, the, the, the attention this project has got today, the fact that we've achieved our four objectives that we set out to do has just been, it's been mind blowing. During his marathon endeavour, he's worn out 22 pairs of trainers, burned two and a half million calories and has raised more than a quarter of a million pounds for charity. When Ben set off, David Cameron still had 10 months left as Prime Minister and Leicester City had only just begun their title winning season. Since when he has run 10 and a half thousand miles. That's the equivalent of London to Sydney, while the weather has not always been quite this pleasant. They won 5-2 in Leeds. And it's snowing! A back injury forced him to stop running for more than a week at one stage, which meant he couldn't set a world record of consecutive daily marathons. However, Ben then did an extra two and a half miles every day to make up the missing distance. And all achieved without a single blister. No blisters, no missing toenails. <laughs> Sorry, they're just a bit dirty. <laughs> Ben's heart is now so enlarged that he needs to return it to a more normal size by winding down gently. And how does he do that? By carrying on running. Tomorrow, just the mere half marathon awaits. Richard Palo, News at 10, Bristol.